the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, has recently uncovered six planets that existed just a fraction of a billion years after the Big Bang. This discovery has shaken up some long-held beliefs in science, particularly regarding the creation and evolution of the universe. Traditionally, the Hubble Space Telescope, HST, has played a pivotal role in measuring the expansion of the universe, specifically the Hubble constant, a key value that determines how fast the universe is expanding. However, recent observations from JWST have complicated this process, adding to the confusion surrounding the rate at which the universe is growing. The discrepancy in measurements of the Hubble constant is known as the Hubble tension. There are two primary methods used to estimate the expansion rate. One relies on the cosmic microwave background, CMB, radiation, which is the afterglow of the Big Bang, while the other uses observations of distant galaxies and their redshifts. These two methods have yielded slightly different results, with measurements based on the CMB suggesting a slower expansion rate than those derived from the observation of galaxies. This discrepancy has persisted for some time, leading scientists to hope that the more advanced capabilities of the JWST might finally resolve the issue. However, the initial data from JWST has not provided a definitive answer. Instead, it has deepened the mystery. The Hubble constant plays a crucial role in cosmology, as it helps scientists determine the distance between galaxies and their speed of recession. The tension between the two methods of measurement isn't just a matter of minor differences. Even small deviations in the expansion rate can have profound implications for our understanding of the universe, especially regarding its age and its evolution. Resolving the Hubble tension is crucial for cosmology, as it could imply the need for new physics or the discovery of unknown components in the universe that current models do not account for. The new JWST observations suggest that the discrepancies in the Hubble constant are unlikely to be due to errors in measurement or instrument limitations. In fact, the JWST's findings challenge the idea that previous estimates from the Hubble Space Telescope, which has been instrumental in measuring the expansion of the universe, were flawed. Rather, the discrepancy may point to something more fundamental about the universe itself, perhaps related to the physics governing its expansion. The Hubble Space Telescope, which was launched in 1990, has been essential in refining our understanding of the universe's expansion. By observing stars and galaxies with unparalleled precision, Hubble has provided astronomers with the data needed to calculate the rate of cosmic expansion. One of the key tools used by Hubble has been the study of Cepheid variable stars, which are stars that fluctuate in brightness in a predictable manner. These stars act as cosmic mile markers, allowing scientists to calculate distances across vast stretches of space. Before Hubble's observations, there was significant uncertainty about the age of the universe, with estimates ranging from 10 to 20 billion years. The Hubble Space Telescope helped narrow down that range and revolutionized our understanding of the universe's age and structure. However, despite these advancements, the discrepancy in the Hubble constant has remained an unresolved issue, with no clear explanation. The JWST's recent findings suggest that the problem may not lie with errors in measurements from the Hubble Space Telescope. Instead, it could be a sign of a deeper mystery, one that may require new theories of cosmology or even new laws of physics to explain. The discovery of distant planets and the continued study of stars and galaxies may eventually lead to an answer, but for now, the Hubble tension remains one of the greatest enigmas the in The study of astronomy. Cepheid stars plays a crucial role in determining vast cosmic distances. The initial step involves observing Cepheids in NGC 4258, a galaxy with a well-established and reliable distance measurement. By comparing the brightness of Cepheids in this galaxy to their known distances, astronomers can calibrate their measurement techniques, setting a solid reference point for accurate distance estimation. The next step focuses on examining Cepheids in galaxies that have recently hosted type IIA supernovae, which are extremely bright explosions used as reliable cosmic markers. By analyzing Cepheids in these galaxies and cross-referencing the data with Hubble's observations, astronomers can validate the precision of their distance estimates. Any discrepancies or variations could provide valuable insights into the underlying factors contributing to the so-called Hubble tension. According to Adam Rees, the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, has made a significant contribution by clarifying whether there was an issue with Hubble's Cepheid distance measurements. 
Reese emphasizes that JWST observations provide strong evidence supporting the accuracy of Hubble's Cepheid star measurements. However, he also points out that discrepancies in the Hubble constant are not necessarily a crisis, but rather a scientific challenge to better understand the reasons behind these differences. For both Reese and the broader scientific community, the key question remains understanding the root causes of these discrepancies. Researchers are focused on unraveling this cosmic mystery, as the variations in measurements may shed light on new aspects of the universe's evolution or fundamental physics. The differences in the Hubble constant may not solely be the result of errors in Cepheid measurements or instrumental limitations. JWST's advanced infrared capabilities offer a deeper understanding of Cepheid stars, providing more accurate distance estimates and potentially addressing some of the fundamental questions about the universe's expansion rate. The ultimate goal of this ongoing research is to reconcile the different measurements and gain a better understanding of the universe. The study highlights the dynamic nature of cosmological research, where new discoveries constantly challenge and refine our understanding of the cosmos. Scientists remain focused on addressing these critical questions, working to resolve the Hubble tension and uncover hidden insights into the universe's true nature. The Hubble tension not only challenges our understanding of cosmic expansion but also suggests the potential existence of unknown phenomena. This disparity might point to the need for new theories or adjustments to our current models of the universe. One of the complicating factors is the role of dark energy and dark matter, which could be influencing measurements in ways that current models have not fully accounted for. Dark energy, the mysterious force driving the accelerated expansion of the universe, and dark matter, which exerts gravitational effects on visible matter, could be altering measurements of cosmic distances in ways that we are still working to understand. The interaction between these forces and the rate of expansion remains a key area of research, with new insights from JWST offering critical clues. Moreover, the Hubble tension could also involve potential errors in our understanding of the universe's early rapid expansion, known as inflation. If our models of the universe's growth shortly after the Big Bang are incomplete, the discrepancies in the Hubble constant could indicate that we need to refine our understanding of these early processes. JWST's ability to observe the universe in unprecedented detail, especially in the infrared spectrum, opens new avenues for exploring these issues. By capturing clearer images of the early universe, JWST could help scientists better understand how the universe evolved from its initial state to its current form. Another area of interest is refining the cosmic distance ladder, a series of methods used to measure distances in the universe. This ladder includes techniques like parallax measurements of nearby stars and the use of standard candles such as Cepheid variables. Each step in the ladder must be carefully calibrated to ensure accurate distance measurements. JWST's observations could help refine these calibrations, potentially resolving some of the discrepancies seen in the Hubble constant measurements. Theoretical implications of the Hubble tension are significant. If the discrepancies cannot be resolved with current models, it could suggest the need for new physics beyond the standard model, including potential modifications to general relativity or the introduction of new fundamental forces. The possibility of such groundbreaking changes underscores the importance of continued observational and theoretical research. Collaborative efforts across disciplines and international research initiatives will be essential in solving this cosmic puzzle. Observatories like JWST, combined with other telescopes and space missions, will provide a more comprehensive view of the universe, helping to unravel the mystery of its expansion and development. In addition to the scientific implications, these discoveries also raise philosophical questions about our place in the universe. Understanding the rate of the universe's expansion and its fundamental properties challenges our perceptions of time, space, and our role in the vast cosmos. As we uncover more about the universe's fundamental mechanics, we gain insights not only into the cosmos but also into the nature of reality itself. In summary, the James Webb Space Telescope's findings related to the Hubble tension are pushing the boundaries of our understanding of the universe. The discrepancies in the Hubble constant measurements may point to deeper, more fundamental issues in cosmology. As researchers continue to analyze the data and explore new theories, the ultimate goal remains to reconcile these differences and develop a clearer, more precise picture of the universe's expansion and its underlying nature.
this journey of discovery promises to expand our knowledge of the cosmos and our place within it. Cepheid stars play a crucial role in helping scientists determine the rate of the universe's expansion. These massive supermonster stars are much larger than our Sun and are prized by researchers as the primary tool for measuring distances to systems millions of light years away. According to Adam Rees, these measurements are essential for determining the Hubble constant, a key step toward unraveling the mysteries of cosmic expansion. Adam Rees, from Johns Hopkins University and the Space Telescope Science Institute, highlighted a unique characteristic of Cepheid stars their pulsating nature. These stars rhythmically expand and contract, and the period of their pulsations is directly related to their intrinsic brightness. Longer pulsation periods correlate with a greater brightness, which serves as a vital standard for accurate distance measurements. The Hubble Space Telescope benefits from its vantage point beyond Earth's atmosphere, allowing it to observe individual stars in galaxies over 100 million light years away. By tracking the fluctuations in the brightness of these stars, astronomers can calculate their distances. However, Hubble faces challenges with infrared light detection due to its relatively low sensitivity to red wavelengths, which limits its ability to detect distant stars effectively. This sensitivity issue makes it difficult to observe Cepheid stars, whose red light may blend with nearby stars in the telescope's view. Infrared observation is crucial for studying celestial objects because light travels vast distances across space and its wavelength stretches toward the red end of the spectrum due to the expanding universe. This phenomenon, known as redshift, makes distant galaxies and objects appear redder when observed from Earth. Infrared light allows astronomers to see through cosmic dust that might otherwise obscure objects, enabling clearer views of stars and galaxies. However, this presents a challenge when trying to measure the true brightness of a Cepheid star hidden behind interstellar dust as it can appear dimmer or its light may mix with nearby stars, causing uncertainty in its observed properties. To address this issue, astronomers use statistical methods to estimate the average effect of this blending on their measurements. While this approach helps, it introduces a level of uncertainty, as it's impossible to precisely account for all variables. The James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, is designed to excel in infrared observations. Unlike Hubble, the JWST has advanced infrared capabilities, allowing it to see through cosmic dust and provide clearer, more accurate observations of celestial objects. By observing Cepheid stars with the JWST, astronomers hope to gain a more detailed understanding of their true brightness and distances, leading to more precise measurements of the universe's expansion rate and refining our knowledge of the Hubble constant. With its enhanced infrared vision, the JWST represents a critical tool for improving the accuracy of these measurements and resolving the discrepancies in our current understanding of cosmic expansion.